Yeah, in terms of my choices, um, Hakim Zayic is fit today, which was uh, the first time he's really been fit to start a game. He's worked really hard to be fit. And I was very keen to get his quality into the team, and I think we saw that for the for the whole period he was on the pitch. He brought a lot of quality and calmness and uh, gets a well-deserved goal. Um, and with Callum on the, on the left wing, I felt Callum deserved a chance uh, to play. He's trained very well recently. We have competition in those areas, um, and we're also in the middle of a very busy um, patch of game, so we need uh, input from, from all the attacking players. And we felt that today with Callum getting his goal, and Hakim, Christian coming on for a goal. So I was very pleased with those parts of our game. And Jorginho has had an incredibly successful rate of scoring penalties in his career, um, particularly at Chelsea. My feeling is when you take that many penalties as he does, there can be periods where you miss one, and sometimes there can be periods where you miss one or two. I experienced that as a player. Um, but I've got no problem at all with his style of taking them because of the success he's had. Um, and Timo Werner, I know he's very capable to take penalties, as we saw. We have other players that can. Um, so I'll talk with the players afterwards to see how we move forward, but we have good takers at the club. How important will Callum Hudson and Doyle's goal be for his confidence? We saw him having ice on his leg. Was that a concern or was it fortunate? Насколько важен гол Калума Хатсона Дой для его уверенности в себе? И мы видели, что ему наложили лед на ногу после замены. Есть ли повод беспокоиться или это было в качестве меры предосторожности? Yeah, I think the goal is clearly going to be good for his confidence. Um, there were things I liked in his game today. His uh, desire to run behind the defence. Um, sometimes 1v1, it didn't quite go his way, but um, I'm very pleased that uh, when you're playing in the Champions League and, uh, and you get your goal, I know the feeling of confidence it can give him. Um, in terms of his injury, um, it hasn't been flagged to me after the match that there's a problem. So I, I assume and I hope that there's nothing wrong. And I'm just pleased that he had a good evening. How satisfied are you with Rudiger's performance after his returning to the squad? And will the Zuma and Rudiger pair will be the main one now? I'm very pleased with the performance tonight of Rudiger and Kurt Zuma. They can take uh, credit for the clean sheet amongst other players. Um, I, I didn't have doubts over Tony. His training and uh, professionalism has been very clear from the beginning since I've been here, and certainly in recent weeks. And I was very pleased with his concentration levels the whole back four, back five with Mendy as well, the concentration levels to, to have a real desire to keep a clean sheet. Going forward, we need more than two centre-backs. We have Thiago Silva at home, we have Tamori and Christensen in the squad. It's not easy to keep five centre-backs happy, but we need the levels of competition that we saw on the pitch today to keep moving forward. Ask. We saw Roman Abramovich at the game tonight. Does that make the victory more important? And did you get a chance to speak to him before or after the game? Yeah, I, I'm, I was aware that he was at the game, obviously, um, which always makes us happy. We all, I always feel the support of the owner of the club, whether he's here at games or not. So to have him here is a nice bonus for, for myself, for the squad. Um, and we are very respectful of him, of course. Um, I, didn't, I didn't manage to see him. Because before the game, I was in the dressing room. A couple of my staff members spoke to him. By the time I came out in the warm-up, he wasn't around. But I'm very pleased we put on what I thought was a good performance with four goals and a clean sheet in his home country. So I hope it made him happy. Can you say that Krasnodar deserved such a big loss today? Um, I thought they played a good match. I expected a competitive match. They had some opportunities to score in the, in the early parts of the second half, in particular, where we felt some pressure. Um, but we were very clinical in how we took our goals. We missed a penalty, which could have meant one more. So I, I'm not concerned. I thought they were a good opponent, and um, maybe they will feel disappointed. But for us, we just have to be happy that we travelled in Europe in the Champions League, which is always tough. And we got the result that we wanted. I'm more concerned about how we feel. Yeah, I thought his performance was very, very good. When you consider he hasn't started a match since, I think, March, when the Dutch league finished. So I've been very excited to get him on the pitch. And um, it's been a frustration for me and for him and for us that his injury is meant he hasn't been able to start. But what I've seen in training so far, what I knew we were signing as a player, as a player of immense quality and personality to receive the ball and find assists, find goals. 
Um, and we saw a lot of glimpses of that today, and he will get better. So, yeah, we brought him in to do a job. Maybe people have forgotten a bit because we signed him in January and he's missed the start of the season. Tonight, he certainly showed that he's here.